I trade the tongue and ready for the bench. I trade the tongue and ready for the bench. Losing my man, man, I'm over this shit. You keep it coming, I'ma roll it again. You keep it coming, I'ma blow it again. I trade the tongue and ready for the bench. Losing my man, man, I'm over this shit. You keep it coming, I'ma roll it again. I was good with you guys. We're back again with another video today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make a trap synth heavy beat for yeet But we're gonna be making a beat for yeet and I'm probably gonna be beating my anyways Yeah, I'm just gonna be showing you guys how to make some like very synth heavy and just you know that the notorious yeet sound I don't know if I should say notorious, but you know that that sound that yeet has that hyper pop super EDM inspired and like just electronic very synth heavy sound and then we're gonna even try and make like a little song after so make sure you guys stay tuned for the end of this after the beats finish I'm gonna try and make like a little song like yeet and depending on how it sounds we might just uh, turn it into something but who knows so before we get started if you guys could do me a few favors make sure you head over to my Instagram and follow me there it's just a great spot for you guys to stay updated and everything like that also the discord server is always down in the description below so if you want to join be part of the community make sure you click that link and as always if you guys could hit that like button for me that'd mean a lot helps push my videos out for more people to see and in turn just makes me make more videos so you know it means a lot. also make sure you guys are commenting on these videos let me know what you guys want to see because i do want to make sure that i'm making videos that are catered to you guys so let me know what you guys like but without any further ado let's jump into fl and make a beat for yeet before we actually jump into fl i do want to show you guys the sounds i'm going to be using basically i'm going to be using all sounds for my new kit cyber which is multi-kit the main part of it is it's a serum bank and a drum kit and then there's a bunch of stuff sprinkled in between like a loop kit a bunch of midi and if you guys don't have serum there's also an option for you you could grab the one shot kit but the bundle includes everything and then something i just did on the website is if you head over to the cyber page and you can do that by heading over to quintinbaba.com click buy now right here and you can scroll down and you can see everything is available separately now or you can get the bundle which obviously you save a lot of money if you're going to do that so you get the serum bank the one shot kit and the drum kit alone or you can get the bundle it's only 47 so i mean obviously that's the way to go but enough talking let's get into fl all right so we're going to keep the bpm at 140 for now and we're going to open up serum and we're going to dive right into cyber and i'm going to be going under the synth sounds right here actually we're gonna be using this one called rockstar and it sounds like this and first thing we're gonna do is just go to the piano roll and i think we're gonna go for something maybe like go for c minor for now basically what i'm doing is i'm just gonna lay down some triads and maybe do a few inversions to make the chord progression sound a little bit more like that yeet style so i'll kind of like break it down as we do it but obviously we're gonna start at the root note which is c we'll bring this up and then flatten it So that's the progression we got right now and i kind of did this a little bit weird obviously we started out with that triad at first and i just flattened that middle note as you can see basically flattening it is just bringing it down a semitone and it kind of gives it just a more dramatic feel so i did that and then brought it up an octave and then for these two i'm not even really sure what i did i kind of was just placing notes that sounded good as the chord progression went on so as you can see these aren't even like triads i just brought up the root note i don't yeah it's not even really like a chord but i don't know it sounds good and that's something you guys should really keep in mind when you're making beats like this you don't gotta follow rules all the time just do whatever sounds good. all right so we're gonna route this out to mix track one and then we're gonna clone that serum and we're gonna grab a lead sound and then just see if we could add something on top of that so let's go back into cyber and just go to these leads <laughs> So basically what I'm doing here is the way I have this lead set up is that it could glide from note to note. So what we're basically doing here is it's sliding from this A sharp to the D right as it starts. So I'll solo that out for you guys. So it has that little glide compared to it being just like that. And then it glides down to this G and then same thing. It goes from this A sharp to the D sharp then back down to the G sharp and so on and so forth. And when we do all of that, we get this sound.
All right, so now we're just going to add a base. So we're going to go back into Serum. Of course, we're going right back to Cyber. And we're going to start with these bases right here. I think this one will work out great just because it has like this. As the base plays, it kind of gets a little bit more grungy. And as you can see, it's set up with this envelope right here. And it's controlling this cutoff knob right here. I'm going to hit Control L on my keyboard, and then we're going to duplicate that over. change this envelope to one bar so we're gonna bring this over here and then one more thing we'll probably add like a bell or something on top of this I'm gonna go to these plucks right here and see what we can find So I routed this to mix track three, and we're just gonna add a bunch of reverb to it. And that's the whole melody right there. So now we're gonna get into the drums. Like I said, we're using Cyber, so we're gonna use it for all the drums in here. So I'm gonna go into the Cyber drum kit, and I think we're gonna start out with, with a snare. Just, or we got that open head just hitting on every beat pretty much and then we're gonna go into the high hit all right so we're just gonna repeat that over for now and then I'm gonna go in and just do some rolls underneath and everything so we're gonna set it to probably like a third step and then just do some rolls in there that works and we're going to duplicate that over for eight and i think it's time for the 808 so we're going to be using this one from my kit called church and we might switch it to rockstar for now we're going to do church we're just going to turn this up all the way go to cut itself and i'm actually just going to copy the bass pattern over for now bring it up an octave so i'm going to go into the 808 and set the envelope settings like this so it doesn't play out too long and then we're just going to make a pattern
I mean, that pattern's fire right there. So now I'm just going to try and like switch out some of the 808, see if we can get a better sound. But I'm really liking this for now. So let's try Rockstar. <laughs> the whole beat right there so now we'll just arrange it render it out and then like i said we're gonna try and do this song in it. all right so well as arranging i actually came up with an idea since we're going in the style of yeet, we're going to make a new pattern here. And if you actually get the cyber drum kit, there is a little secret included. I've gone over this in a few videos before. But if you go in the one-shot kit and you go under, I believe it's the plugs. So if you go in the one-shot kit, which you could either get in the bundle or you could get it by itself. But if you go under the keys, there is this secret.wave. And what we're going to do is just drag this into FL Studio. And we're going to make sure we do cut itself. We're just going to turn this up and route it to like mixed track. Uh, let's do four here. And we're just going to make a pattern. And just duplicate that over. We'll hit Control L. And boom. Now we got the bell. That's the whole beat right there. So now we're going to render this out. And like I promised, we're going to make a little song. All right, so we're just going to drag the beat back in here. And we're just going to pull the volume down a little bit. We're going to route this out to mix track one. If you guys are looking to do something similar, make a song like this. If you don't just want to fuck around and freestyle on it. If you head over to queendababa.com, go to vocal templates. I'm going to be using the Yeet Get Busy template, which as you can see is 100% FL Studio stock. So if you guys want to do the same thing and you have FL Studio, you can do that very easily. I don't know. I don't know. I traded Tonga writing for the bands. Ah, losing my mind, man. I'm out of these shoes. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Keep it coming, I'ma roll it again. Keep it coming, I'ma blow it again. Losing my mind, man. I'm out of the barrel. Keeping it going, I'm losing my mind, man. I'm out of the barrel. I'm running all over. Back in that bitch and I roll it again, blow it again Keep it coming, I'm going to win I Go with the women, I shoot my little shot and I go with the lead Shoot my little shot when the time's up, hit with a hit with a bang huh? Oh, why you wanna talk that? Oh, I live what I talk about, don't get it twisted Oh, I live what I talk about, don't get it twisted Oh, Alright, I think that's good for the video See you in the next one, doses Losing my mind when I'm off with a barrel Keeping it going, I'm losing my mind when I'm off with a barrel I'm running all oh, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah High at the tongue, I'm ready for the best Losing my mind when I'm off with this shit Keep it coming, I'ma roll it again Keep it coming, I'ma blow it again